Back at the Seattle Boat Show, and we are with Mark Lawton from Union Marine, and we are getting aboard a brand new boat to the Northwest, the Aviera 36. Correct. And I'm going to pass it over to you, Mark, and let you take us through this stunning boat. Thanks very much, Rick. As you mentioned, it's a brand new boat brand for Union Marine, uh, exclusively sold here in the uh, uh, Pacific Northwest. Aviara is not a new boat brand. They've actually been manufactured since 2019. It's a European style boat, but made in America, Merritt Island, Florida to be specific. Mastercraft Holdings, the parent company, it's a boat luxury without limits. So today I'm gonna to walk you through the 36 Aviar, a nice day boat that you can actually overnight on. At 36 feet, eight inches uh, long and 10 foot, 10 beam, a very stable, secure boat. Kind of rides like a Cadillac, drives like a sports car. So, um, so let's take a look. Let's do it. This is uh, just beautiful. Thank you. Uh, one of the unique features of the Avro boat brand here on this particular model is the stadium seating or the bar stools that you see. Kind of like just an office chair, but they are adjustable. So whether you're going to be enjoying uh, Seafair weekend or watching uh, Blue Angels or, or maybe a uh, 4th of July celebration, it's a nice way to view the, view the action. So somebody can be sitting up here. You have another level right below. And of course, somebody can be sitting on the swim step. So not obstructing the view of anyone. So great way to entertain a great social boat. Now, if you just want to recline, I've stationed these uh, um, uh, at different elevated de levels. So maybe if you're laying back here and you just want to use these as a headrest, it's a nice way to lounge. Thank you so much for exhibiting this year. Have a great day. Coming inside the boat, you've got a nice, easy transom walkthrough. Dedicated stowage below here for your fenders. Right? Oh, that's nice. And if you notice the quality of construction of the Avro boat brand, specific attention to detail. Everything is nice and finished, stainless steel hinges. One of the things that they do on their boats as well is unlike some manufacturers, well, they'll just screw the seats on. These are actually through bolted. And notice all the fit and finish of the Avro boats. Coming inside, again at a 1010 beam, it's got plenty of room for all your family and your friends and everybody else as well. 34 cup holders, so plenty to provide for your drinks. You've got a nice day kitchen here, a night kitchen, electric griddle. You have a refrigerator below. A nice fresh water sink and a place for your wine bottles as well. Again, lots of seating, but also lots of storage. Underneath here, you have a dedicated cooler with drain. I actually have my belongings in there right now. <laughs> and then lots and lots of deep storage for the other gear. Yeah, storage is massive, but space everywhere is yeah. expensive. Lots of storage, lots of space. There is a table that fits here that's optional, so now you can have a nice social zone for the boat. Moving forward a little bit here, you do have rear-facing or forward-facing seating, so when you do have the table and you're entertaining your guests, everybody can be part of the conversation. On the port and starboard side, you do have bolsters, so you can sit a little bit higher up, get a little bit better visibility. Avera is known for luxury without limits. Uh, some of their uh, things that they offer as well as elevated control on the helm station. It's a little higher up for bed, better visibility and easy to use. And again, you've got twin bolster seats. The other feature on this boat that they brought in, with, which is actually standard on Avera boat brands, is the joystick. So when it comes to docking the boat, it takes all the stress and angst out of it. Very easy to do. Yeah, it's beautifully laid out helm. Little glass. Back here. Going inside, as I mentioned, this is a nice day boat that you can overnight on. You've got a nice big cutting cabin below, magnetic strip to hold the door open so it's not uh, going back and forth on you. 
inside a nice big berth, sleeps two to four comfortably. There is a table option that actually goes down below with a filler cushion to make that bed even bigger. We brought it in with the optional TV, soundbar system, and a microwave. So at night, it's a great place to make some popcorn, watch a movie. And then inside here is actually a walk-in enclosed head whoosh shower. And because we brought this boat in with a generator and shore power, you do have air conditioning and heat in the cabin, as well as heat, heat in the cockpit. Yeah, the head is just huge. And uh, you have, what, what is your clearance here? Head, head, so it's got to be at least 6'5". Six, 6'5", five. Six, five, sure. Sea decking all the way throughout the boat, very comfortable on your feet, easy to clean, easy to maintain. Another feature of the RVR boats is this way they're uh, constructed. Uh, it's a very deep bee hole with a lot of freeboard for safety. Uh, walking up towards the bow, you've got a wind block off door. It's very easy to use. Shut this and you shut your windshield that prevents that wind from going into your passengers and up over the helm. And walking forward, again, if you'll notice the amount of freeboard the boat has. I was about to ask you, what is the, what is the height of it? It's actually about uh, a little over four feet. Sure. So nice and deep. As a matter of fact, when you're sitting in the, in the bow of the boat, it'll actually come up to your shoulders. Absolutely. So if you have children or adults, it's a nice, safe place to sit. You're not going to get bounced out of the boat, nor will you take any water over the bow. This is not your, your basic lake. Bow rider. This is correct. Uh, this this boat's meant for the big water as well. Sure. So whether you want to spend a day on the lake or go up to Roach Island and spend a night on the islands, it's a great place to do it. And underneath, you have lots and lots of storage. Also, underneath the seats, eight cup holders for your friends, charging for your phone, and its boat does come with the optional windlass. Again, if you'll notice the quality of the fit and finish in Monavio boat brand, everything is finished off nicely. You have a remote control for your windlass at the bow and then also can use it at the helm. So it's a great way to bring your anchor up without doing all the work. Absolutely beautiful. If you notice the aluminum billets, aluminum windshield frame. So again, nice quality construction and quality detail. It's a European style boat, but made in America. So one of the other nice features of the Avio boat brand is the fact that if you look at the upholstery, Nice fit and finish. There's no stitching here. It's nice and smooth, easy to wipe clean. And you, what, again, what is powered with? Uh, so this is actually, this particular boat is powered with Ilmore engines. They're twin engines. They're uh, 6.2 liter, uh, 430 horsepower side, so plenty of power. And another nice thing about Ilmore engines, they do come standard with freshwater cooling. So whether in the freshwater or saltwater, this boat is meant to go anywhere. Absolutely. Just a beautiful boat, and uh, it definitely needs to be not, not your typical Northwest boat, but this is a boat that would absolutely work anywhere, as you say, to go to the San Juan Islands or just down on Lake Union. And you just want to anchor out and spend the night again with all the features that you have on there. You can do it very nice and comfortably. So that's our RBR 36, Rick. Come on down and see us at Union Marine. Well, I can't thank you enough, Mark. I appreciate you taking us through the boat and taking the time. It is absolutely gorgeous, and we will definitely be seeing more of Aviara and more of you. Appreciate look, it. Look forward to seeing you on the water. Thank, thank you. you. Take care.